Hi, everybody, and welcome to our at-home show. You know, today, we're gonna brighten up your home. We're gonna get you ready for spring. Did you know that you can actually grow in your own strawberries? Did you know that, Pete? Grow your own strawberries thanks to our friends at Meadow Valley. That's gonna be coming up a little bit later with Michael Perry. Love Michael, he's gonna be joining us. But our show is all about great stuff. In our uh, At Home 101 segment, we're gonna reveal the meanings behind various colors of flowers. We've got that and a whole bunch more. It's all coming up, Spring Home Essentials on At Home. at midnight we are launching a brand new today's special but your eyes lucky as they are are getting a sneak peek before it comes up at midnight this thing is amazing what a machine if i told you you could turn your ordinary garden hose into a high-powered cleaning machine you'd probably consider that right why rent when you can own your own this is a brand new exclusive hsn earthwise design the card actually makes it easy to pour it around you can go anywhere you need to go we've got 1800 pounds per square inch of pressure that is huge gonna blast away dirt and dust and grime and mold and mildew look at the before and afters of a job we did look at that mildew at the bottom of that now what would you do you get a scrub brush toothbrush you're gonna scrape that off or are you gonna use the power of a pressure washer? Look at these, all before and afters. You can get in the hardest to reach areas, like the blinds, maybe your garage door, any area of your home that you wanna clean, you can utilize with this eco-friendly, uh, user-friendly technology. Peter Kilcullen is here. Hi, Hi Pete. Oh, yes. You know what I love? For, first of all, I own one of the first ones you ever brought here. Yeah. I've had it for five years. Little small unit, I think it was 12 or 1400 PSI. Sure. Uh, this is much more powerful than that, but I love the new design of the caddy it's amazing it makes it so much easier to move around so if you're a senior out there and you're worried I can't move a, a pressure washer around this is designed like the industrial ones it's, that you see it at the home store but on a HSN level it, right? exactly it really I mean every year that we can bring you a better pressure washer I'm so amazed Look because that. what you want out of a pressure washer is exactly that easy to use like you're talking about guy it's easy to move around but think about this we give you 1800 psi we're gonna give you four differing spray nozzles and yeah. then a fifth being our turbo nozzle which is amazing you get all of that guy what about our 25 feet of pressurized hose right. you can walk around the entire car the entire patio Huge. or deck to use your pressure washer this is the largest detergent tank we've ever had guy you remember when we had a little tiny detergent tank right on and, the and, handle and, yeah right, and then the one. soap would be gone in about a minute but here 64 ounces and this pressure washer only uses 1.2 gallons yeah. per minute, which is amazing and far less than when you're using that's, your, that's your garden tank. hose. Yeah, it's there's unbelievable. Extra large tank. Everything is loaded on board. Your extra um, uh, brush tips are up here on the top so you can get different uh, amounts of pressure, a different exactly. style of pressure. Uh, the turbo nozzle is included as well. This price today is ridiculous. It's $30 off. We're going to ship it to your house for free. And Peter... Anybody can do this. I mean, it's pretty easy. You're doing it with one hand. <laughs> it, it absolutely is. Here's why everyone loves the pressure washer. You're watching me do these pavers. This could be the driveway, the sidewalk. It could be the wooden deck. It could be that, that uh, PVC fence. But what's so great about this is you get this out with very little work. You get amazing results. You saw those before and afters. You can do that with no experience, with no skill, with just using this extremely lightweight lance and the power from ordinary water and your ordinary garden hose. Look at that fence. That's not replaced, guy. That's not a new fence. Look at the old weathered fence. And I, I talked to Tim, who did that fence for us. That whole area, we're talking about less than a minute for each one of those panels. So 15 minutes, 20 minutes, you yeah. can do that whole area. That's crazy. It looks brand new. You can get those same results. Now, I think almost all of us can look all around the house. What do you have? The slimy green stuff all over the foundation. Maybe it's the, uh, the brick that we're seeing there. This will change it. It'll do it immediately. You will love the pressure washer. All right, so everybody that orders today, since you're the first eyes that see it, you have your choice of color. What happens every time, Peter, you know this, we sell out of these colors every time. So if you want, the, the, this is our turquoise up top. It's what we're calling teal color. It's kind of a tealy turquoise color, uh, which is different from our regular blue. If you come down front, we have the regular blue color. It comes in this graphite gray, kind of a steel color. It comes in purple. 
It also comes in red, which is always a quick salad. It comes in green and it comes in yellow. And if you come in on the yellow one really quick, I'll show you some of the features that Peter was talking about up close. So here's the new tank. This thing is huge. So you got 64 ounces of soap that you can hold inside here, which is much more than the other ones that we did. Here's the motor itself. Now, what I love about this is we have an electric motor. Why is electric so great? Well, number one, it's reliable. You can always count on an electric motor. Uh, there's no gas, there's no fumes, there's no oil. There's nothing to, to do to have to maintain this plug it in, and you'll notice that when Peter isn't using it, it's quiet. When you have a regular, uh, sort of a piston-driven, uh, motorized machine, it, it's constantly running, it's making noise, when you hit the trigger, it makes 10 times the noise, this is relatively quiet, and it only, inst it only activates when Peter pulls the trigger. So, love it, love it, love it, Pete. What else you got it for? I mean, look at this on those, on those stepping stones, the pavers. Maybe you've built yourself a little uh, fire pit with these types of stones. Look at the difference just getting that power into all those nooks and crannies on those stones. It is amazing what you can do with this. And I'll tell you, again, it's going to be your favorite tool around the house because it is so simple to use. Look at that. I mean, those are the kind of results. And I need to, I gotta finish that. I'm gonna get all front. There we go. And get that all done. It's so simple. It's so amazing. Bring everything back to the way it looked when you first built it, yeah. installed it, when you first bought your house. Think about all the things you can use the pressure washer for. First and foremost is going to be, you're gonna be able to wash the car, the right. boat, the RV, all your fun stuff around the house. But then the exterior of your house, and then every hard surface all around your house. So you can walk out your front door, and it's yeah. the, little pa uh, the little porch, and then the walkway, you're gonna be able to do it. And guy, we're including that turbo nozzle. I'll show you that in a minute. So yeah. when you want to do the entire driveway, the turbo nozzle is going to give you the power, yeah. but be able to cover more space in, in less time. You know what we love is at my house, like Danny and I, when we do car washing day, it's so much easier having this. Oh, it's, it's the so best. Funny because I was doing my car because it's a smaller car, and I was doing it the old-fashioned way with a, with a uh, sponge. And Danny's like, Dad, do you, you got to use the, you got to use the, uh, the the pressure washer. It's so and ours easy. isn't this one. Ours is a smaller one. But he does his truck with it. You can right. get the brake dust off the tires with it. You can get the cobwebs, the, the you know the little little mud dauber things that get in your get in your shingles. Oh yeah. Blows them right off. Well, we have to get to the exterior of your house. That might be the next best thing yeah, to using this yeah. for. Whether you have vinyl siding, look at this on the pool deck. It's amazing. Look at the difference on that. You talked about it at the very beginning, guy. How would you clean some of these areas if you didn't have a pressure washer? How would you? it like you said a sponge are you gonna wipe it use a brush how about this with our zero degree tip guy we can reach 16 feet in the air and still deliver the power but look at a huge driveway that turbo nozzle is gonna be fantastic yeah. you are going to get instant results I want to show you this on a fence I mean those are some great areas we're seeing right there but let me show you on this piece of fence the fence gets mold mildew it starts to get yeah. weathered watch this I go right to that wow. fence and we showed you before and after That's that Tim awesome. had done, but look at this. Don't think about replacing your fence, your wooden deck, the railing up to your deck. You can bring it back to new with very little work. I mean, look at that, I'm doing nothing. And I want you to see that. That's our 25 degree tip. So you see how it has that little bit of spread right there. Yeah. With a pressure washer, you can stay further away <laughs> If you need more power, you get a little bit closer right. yep. and you get those results. But that's just one of the four different tips that we give you, plus getting that turbo yeah, nozzle. And it I is amazing. I want to show everybody too, don't forget too, that th this is a little graph that kind of shows you the tips and what they're applicable for and what they work for. These load up right on the top of the unit and you'll see right. how they, they're even, uh, there's even a little message under each one so you know exactly what the intensity of the sprayer is and you also know which one to use when you want to apply soap. So we make it really, really easy for you. This is a today's special pre-sell. Uh, these are gonna go away so this is an opportunity to get it before it launches tonight at midnight. And one of the other right. things I wanted to mention, which is really huge with this, is the amount of reach that you have with this. Because you're getting 25 feet which of pressure Which is incredible. Hose. That's huge, because I think in the early models, we had 15 feet, maybe 20. Oh, no, no. When, I, when we first started doing it, exactly, like it was feet. 10 or less. Yeah. You were always attached to the machine. Right. So you constantly had to move it and drag it yeah. with you. This is really easy to move, and then we give you 25 feet. Right. So imagine if you were washing the car. 
you're all the way around that car. And you car. have plenty of room. Exactly. Yeah. If you want to do that entire deck area, you never have to move the unit. I think that's an amazing part of this. The, the hose has become a lot more flexible, that high pressure hose, so it's easy to coil it up and put it away. If you recall years ago, you were fighting with that pressurized hose. Now it is so simple. So guy, let's get to the turbo nozzle. I've got it right here. I've got that turbo nozzle on. And I want you to see on these brick pavers that we have, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna just try to do it right in the middle so you can see what that turbo <laughs> nozzle does. You see that? So we're spinning that powerful 1800 PSI in a circle. So I'm gonna be able to cover more ground, but I'm gonna be able to just wind this up. You hear that? It's like a helicopter taking off, but it is a tornado of power. So it allows me to cover those areas faster and easier. So everyone who has used a turbo nozzle just knows how fast it is delivering that power. Listen to that guy, you cannot beat that. So if you have that entire driveway, look at that cone of power. It's incredible what you get with this turbo nozzle. So we always want to include that because listen, even if you were going to rent, yeah. You, you know, maybe you go out and you think, I need to rent a 3,000 PSI pressure washer. Nah, you I, don't. I, well, I, you don't need it, <laughs> and I caution you that, uh, you know, those things can cause a little bit of damage. But yeah. even if you have, now we include a zero degree tip. That's that, that jet laser right. point to get a little bit further. If you had to use that one on a huge driveway area, it would take you such a long time. The turbo right. nozzle is gonna cut that I, time in half and still deliver the power. The one that I, I see have. you coming at me. You, yeah, you just, want this. I, I do. You but want the a truck. The original one that I have, <laughs> It came with a turbo nozzle, and I right. have an outdoor deck, and the outdoor deck is that man-made material because it supposedly doesn't get moldy sure, or mildewy. Sure, sure, the deck And I got yeah. this black spotty mold all over the deck, and I didn't know what to do with it. I even asked uh, a friend of mine who's, who's, you know, knows a lot about chemicals. He goes, nothing's going to get that off because it's in, exactly. it's actually down in the pores of the material except the pressure washer. I use this tip. It looked like a brand new deck in like an hour. It right, took you can me. do the whole thing. Oh my gosh! Hey, Pete. try these. We've yeah. got these stepping stones over here. And by the way, another thing about this that I love: notice there's no dripping. Okay, this, this, right. this the tip of this. You see the fittings on there. You have brass fittings. When you turn it on, I'll do something really quick and just stay tight on the actual turbo nozzle for a sec if you can, and you'll watch. When you turn it on, you see how? Look at that. That is, there's no waste. It's a professional machine, right? You don't see it completely shuts off. And this is the nozzle you use to do most of the work around the house. If and you those got large pavers, areas. Yeah. Even on the fence, if you have a large fence, I mean, look at that thing go. And you just work it back and forth. It'll get inside the, uh, the cracks and crevices very, very easily. So if you've got stone work, or if you have pile, uh, outdoor stuff, if you need to clean gutters, you know, if you, uh, if you get up on a ladder and you want to clean out the gutters, you can do that kind of thing. I mean, if you get in really tight, that's how you yeah. do that little detail yeah, cleaning. exactly. The, the closer you get, the more power that you're getting. So if you're concerned about an area, if it's a wooden deck or patio furniture, start a little bit further away. And if you need more power, you go in close. Look at that. You are going to be amazed. But look at how quickly you're doing it. That's to me, fast. that's the big difference is that you're able to do it quickly yeah. and effectively. All right, we're going to move outside. And while we do that, I want to remind everybody again, uh, we do have all those colors available. So it comes in teal, yellow, green. Red is the always, it always seems to be the fastest, doesn't it, Rob? So red's going fast. It's followed by blue. I have it in purple. And then I have it in that steel gray color again. So it really depends. They all do the same thing. If color matters to you, go ahead and grab it. This is not launching till midnight tonight. There's, it's gonna sell out. We only brought in about 15,000. It sells out every year at this time. And you know, realistically, this is the time of year you need it. Winter was rough and very long. In fact, it's still hanging out in a lot of places. So your house is gonna be covered in, what, you know, the, the, the debris from snowfall. It's pollution, dust, dirt, grime. You're gonna start getting mildew as we transition into springtime. This is a way to clean your entire house. This is a way to empower yourself, you know? You don't have to rent one for $100 a day. Why not buy one for $169? It'll pay for itself <coughs> easily in the first month that you use it this summer. Use it to wash your car. If you have a boat, use it to clean your boat. It'll get the crud off the bottom of the boat. Uh, use it on your, <coughs> on your RV. Use it on the brake dust on your tires. Anywhere you want to change it. There's no other way to really clean your house than with a pressure washer. That's why people pay everybody. But I'll tell you, it's the best car washer 
I've ever seen, and it's great for your outdoor stuff too. Pete's over there by his automobile. What do you got, Pete? Yeah, I mean, you're exactly right. You're going to get your pressure washer home. You're going to do all these different things around the yard. I mean, obviously, I think it's going to become your spring and summertime addiction is going around and using this pressure washer. But washing the car on a weekly basis is great. So check this out. I've put the 40 degree tip on there. So you're going to see, I'll show you that. So it's a wider fan spray. So not as strong, but what I'm going to do is use it to just get the car wet, get all the loose dirt off the car. I can do that with that 40 degree tip. And then what's so cool about this, and we talked about it earlier, is that we have that huge soap and detergent tank. So what I'll do is I'll go back here and I want you to see that. Check this out, right here in the front of the machine, 64 ounces right there. And you've got a huge um, opening there so you can put your car wash in there. But remember, it's not just for car wash. Even if it's for um, soap to clean the house or maybe it's something to clean the deck, you can put it in there. And then here's what we do. We're gonna go to our different tips. I'm gonna grab the soap dispensing tip. So that's our low pressure tip. And I want you to see these. These are all brass tips. And then there's the brass connection. So what I do is I pull that down, put the tip in there, and now I'm set. So this is going to be, you know, the, the low uh, pressure because you want to put the soap on, but you don't want to put the soap everywhere. And remember, if you went to rent one or to buy one, these are the same exact tips, those brass tips that you see everywhere. Now watch as I'm able to put just a, a tremendous amount of soap on here. But previously on some of those pressure washers, you would go through the soap so quickly, you would have to redo it again and again. But now, how about this? Getting all that soap under the wheel wells where all that sand and salt from the winter has been, I mean, look at that completely covered in soap. So this can be the car and the boat and the RV. So now I'm gonna switch that back. I'm gonna go back to this uh, 40 degree. And I love that they stay all nice and organized on the top of your pressure washer. Pop that back in, it's seconds to go back and forth between the different tips. And now I can start to rinse that off. You'll see a little bit more soap comes out that's left in the line. But once that clears, now, I'm able to just wash the car. But what I'm not doing is I'm not in a bucket. I'm not searching for those old rags. I mean, look at that, some of that, as I get closer, I can see some of the dirt on there. And then I just blast it away. There's some more dirt. And look at that, it does such a great job. You're getting in all those difficult areas. The, the uh, headlights, but here I love it. The best is the wheels and the tires. And there's that wheel well. Look at the rims, you can just blast away all the dirt and grime. I mean, this is the way to wash the car. It just makes it easy. And you still have that 25 feet of pressurized hose going all around the car. Now, I know I've got to wash the rest of this car, but there's so much more I want to show you over here. For instance, oh, here's a great one. And here's that 25 foot, I can go so far away from the actual unit. But how about this guy, patio furniture, this wicker furniture, maybe it's the newer PVC wicker as well. Getting into that's almost impossible, but look at this. When I'm using that pressure washer and I can get all that power into the nooks and crannies and blast away all the dirt and grime. I mean, this is the way to clean. You are gonna get instant results. You're gonna be moving all around the outside and just blasting away whatever is out there. Now here, I still have that 40 degree tip on. If it's the old cooler, maybe you left that out for the winter time. It just is amazing what you can do with this. Now, I wanna go back and we haven't shown you the zero degree. Now the zero degree, this is the one that we're gonna use when we wanna get the most distance and the most power, because this is gonna be that laser jet point. So I wanted you to see this on the barbecue grill. I mean, look at that. Now that's the power. And if you want even more power, now you can hear it on that metal grill, blasting away all the dirt and grime. Remember, these are all the things that you've left outside over the winter. But how about this, the outside of your house? I think maybe the car and certainly those hard surfaces, the driveway and sidewalk, but the outside of your house is going to be what you want to you know, concentrate on the most. With the zero degree tip, we can reach that second story. We're going 16 feet in the air, still delivering the power. So whether you have vinyl siding, you have the brick face, stucco, with aluminum siding, this is going to be the way to go. You're gonna be able to blast it clean so fast, so easy.
I mean, there's nothing else like it. Anyone can handle this. This this whole unit right here, the lance and the gun, it only weighs a few pounds. So if it's the storm doors and windows and shutters, guy, there isn't anything easier than getting clean after a long winter with your pressure washer. The way. You know, this is our HSN exclusive design. What we did is we made it more into like a trolley so that and it's got a cushion grip up top so that you can take this and port this around anywhere you need to take it. So if you are working around the car, if you're working around a boat, if you're working around your RV or you're just doing the exterior of your house, remember you have, you have 60 foot of reach because you have a 25 foot pressure hose and you have 35 feet of cord. Uh, again, and, and you know, Peter was cleaning the grill. You know what I did too, Pete? I actually pulled out my barbecue grill grates that I couldn't get clean, even with steel wool. And I use those with a little bit of steel wool. It's like a brand new grate. There's no way to get it cleaner. Let me go through the colors uh, again. Well, you wanna do colors and then we'll do before and afters, okay? So let's do colors really quick. So the yellow, I love the yellow. I think the yellow is awesome. Kind of looks very industrial. There's all the tips that you need. And don't forget, uh, it's electric, no gas, no oil. You plug it in, you're good to go. It's eco-friendly, you have no uh, exhaust fumes. It comes in green. The most popular, my producer Rob tells me is red. Uh, we also have it in purple. This is it in uh, the gray. This is, believe it or not, the second most popular. And then it also comes in blue. And then teal is behind me. It's very easy to set up. In fact, I'll walk over to Pete. Let's, when somebody gets this home, yeah, they look at it and they go, oh my gosh, it looks like a, it's like a very scary piece of equipment. But it's pretty easy, right? No, definitely. Uh, again, I love seeing that fence and then that brick. It looks like a chimney area, but I mean, it's amazing. Here, Guy, I'll let you hold on to this because I want you to you. do some more on that exterior of the house. Yeah. But you're exactly right. If you're wondering like how difficult it is to get this set up so you can start using your pressure washer, if you've never done it before, I still think it's gonna take you about two or three minutes. Right. Because it makes it so simple. Here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna come out and you're gonna take your regular garden hose that you have, and I'll turn that for you. And look, it's just gonna it's gonna plug right in, right, Pete? Right here, just like you attach your hose to that, you know, to your faucet outside. It's that simple. You hook it up right there, and then I'm gonna turn it back around the other way. When you get it, you're gonna get the, that 25-foot pressurized hose. And again, that just threads on the back, and there you can see the cord. You're gonna plug that in turn your water on, and guess what? You're ready to go. You have now supercharged your garden hose. If you wanna to start to use this for the washing the car, or you wanna use it to then um, use it to clean the deck, because you can put all kinds of different detergents in there, guy. Right. All you do is put it in there. Look, we just got a cap right there. You fill that up. And then when you use that low pressure soap tip, which is right here, they're all labeled on the back. You can't make a mistake. You are going to, it'll put the soap on automatically when using the low pressure tip. When you change back to the others, it'll go back to the pressure. It's all indicated on the back. It is that simple. So that's the best thing about a pressure washer. You don't have to have any experience, but you are gonna go all around your house. You're gonna see immediate results. You know, I always joke for a lot of the guys out there like me, if you have a, a honey-do list, you've gotta get some stuff done, <laughs> you wanna go straight to the pressure washer because you get so many jobs done so quickly, so easily, and the results are immediate. I mean, look at that. The garage yeah. door's a great one. You don't know how dirty your garage oh door is until you hit it with the pressure washer. Oh, Lord. So there we're seeing the exterior of the house. So, yeah. guy, you can hit that as well. I'm gonna do the house, and remember, you can add soap and you can utilize the soap if you of want course. to. Yeah. Because I don't know about how your house is, but I have, I, I don't have a really big house. It's pretty small. But if you have a second or third story, how are you gonna wash those windows off? How are you gonna get the gunk off? Right. You use a pressure washer and you can clean virtually anywhere. Look at these windows. I don't know if you come in tight on the window. Yeah, but and I'll show you why. What's cool about that, guy, is you're talking about the storm doors, you're talking about the screens. Guy, what about cleaning the screens right. without removing right them? Through, the right? bugs, the dirt, yeah, all the that. cobwebs like you talked about. But it doesn't matter what kind of house you have, if it's stucco, if it's brick face, if it's wood siding, aluminum, vinyl, you are going to love the difference. Guy, I have a yellow house. Now, my wife Debbie always corrects me that it's lemon. It's not is. yellow, it's, it's lemon color. It's lemon color. And when you use it's a pressure lemon, washer, Peter. exactly. It's lemon, because she's got an English accent. <laughs> when you use that, that pressure washer on there, you are amazed. When I mean black dirt just pours off the house from using a pressure washer, you are going to love it. Because again, that could take days. How would you clean your house? And using your garden hose is not going to work. Yeah. This is over 50 times more powerful than your garden hose. You get great results. We give yeah. you all the different tips that you need. And look, I want, I want you to look at something here, okay? There is no way, unless you get a scrubber and you by hand, no, try to go in no these slats, right? That. Or if you have shutters, <laughs> how else are you gonna clean this? 
You'd have to get over there. And plus, if it's if it's 10 feet in the air, now you gotta get on a ladder. Watch what I do. This is the smart way to do it. I just stand back and I don't, you know, you, know, you could be this far back. Watch how it gets underneath. Look. Look at that. Yeah, that's vinyl siding, guy. I mean, that can get so dirty if it's white or gray or yellow. What, you know, beige colored house is very popular. It gets so dirty. This gets it clean quickly. And I know that many of you will find the lower parts of the house guy, you know some of the houses have the uh, exposed foundation, so you see the cinder block, and it always gets slimy and green. It just makes such quick work right, of it. Peter. It's gonna be so simple. You ready? Hey, guys. Look, wait. That, that was John, awesome. How long <coughs> would that have taken me? Literally, how long I would mean, that have taken me? Rob, our producer, says about it. That was less than a minute. How long oh, yeah. would that have taken if I had a bucket and I had soap in my hands and I had a scrub brush? I'd be there for 20 minutes doing this one section, then I'd have to get the ladder out. No exactly. time for that, Pete. So, guy, I want you to run through some. I'm gonna, I'll change out these tips, okay. and you can do some of these different pavers and All things. Right, bro. Because I, we're running out of time. So that I was know. our zero degree. Then we're gonna go to the 25 degree tip. You put that on, those brass tips. So why don't you use that? How about on that fence? Yeah, because yeah, Because yeah. I why? think seeing the difference in the fencing, how it can go from so, old, worn out, weathered, you think you need to replace it. do. And this Watch. is real fence that we gathered here from here in Florida. Watch. And the difference is unbelievable. Amazed. I'll just do the one in the middle. Watch. The closer you go, the better it works if it's really stubborn. Yeah, watch. I'm trying not to get it on me here, but look at it. Look at, look at. Look at that. I mean, all that now green watch. mold and everything. Yeah, look at that one next to it. It's amazing. So, Guy, you've done that. I'm going to grab that turbo nozzle because everyone's got to wow. see the turbo nozzle before yeah. we're done. So the fence can look brand new, but that could be the deck. It could be all of those areas around the house, the sidewalk. But now let's talk about a huge patio, the whole driveway. Watch let's this. use that turbo by nozzle the way, on there. I have one hand in my pocket. All right, I got one hand in my pocket while I'm doing this. Watch me. <laughs> and you dress nicely. La, 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 la. This is literally. I mean, that's you can, have a glass, you can have a glass of wine in your other hand. Right, Pete? Or a glass of soda for Pete. Look at it. Sorry that, sorry that took so long. Here. Look, you want to do the bricks? I'll just look at it. Right <laughs> off, look at it. Look, 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 look. look. <laughs> sorry that took so long. I mean, it, it, it does, it, not only does it look easy, it is easy, guys. I hand it off to you. You did Thank great. You, my friend. Well, I, you know what? And I'm, I, I love the 1800 PSI. Yes, yeah, it's, it's so nice. Powerful as can be. Perfect for the homeowner. Uh, you, you, you don't rent, you own it. You'll have it right. whenever you need it. I'll guarantee you this. You buy this? Neighbor's gonna knock on your door and say, hey, uh, I noticed you got a fancy, can I borrow that? Oh, Be a that good will neighbor, happen. <laughs> let them use it because they're gonna love it and you're gonna love having it. Uh, stick around because I know we got Peter, great job. Thank you, Peter sir. Peter launches tonight at midnight. Right. So if you wanna check it out again, uh, make sure you do. Hey, by the way, you know, uh, we, this is our at-home show, so we've got something we call At Home 101. Uh, what is that all about? Well, let me tell you, gang. So uh, you want to make flowers a wonderful gift for somebody? It's perfect. Whether you want to give a, a bouquet to your friend or partner or a new mom or, you know, anybody, all flowers carry a very meaningful sentiment with them. So visit HSN's Outdoor Living Board on Pinterest, and you can learn what different flower colors and different flower types mean. Okay. Coming up in just a few bits. Check it out. This is the Meadow Valley Pretty Woman Treetop Lily Collection. You're talking about big, bold, beautiful, and an amazing fragrance. Uh, these are perfect uh, mid to late summer bloomers. We've got those available today as we enter into our Meadow Valley segment with my very, very good friend, Michael Perry, who I love, and you love Michael too. He's gonna be joining us for the second half of our show. But if you wanna get a sneak peek at some of the items, he's got that, he's got, oh, he's got the pink. He has pink lily of the valley too. If you've never, very rare to find the pink the lily of the valley. So all that is coming up next as we continue. Stick around, At Home continues with beautiful flowers from Meadow Valley. Don't miss a thing with our HSN app, available on Apple and Android devices. Get $10 off your first in-app purchase with code WELCOME10. Opt in to push notifications for early access to exclusive app-only deals. Shop faster than ever with exclusive new product videos, only on the iPhone. Watch HSN Live anytime, anyplace. And the new shop and search features make finding your favorites easier than ever. Search app on hsn.com to download. 
There's so many things to love about HSN, but one thing that makes shopping here fun is FlexPay. Get it home now without the stress of paying all at once. Why pay full purchase price today when you can pay over time? Buy what you want now. Pay it off later with your credit or debit card. FlexPay. It's that easy. Exclusively at HSN. a little piece of plastic could be so much fun. Now, when you apply for the HSN card, instantly get $10 off. It's all about you. Extra flex on the things you love. Now, when you use your HSN card, you get extra flex all day, every day on all jewelry, beauty, and fashion purchases. Plus, no interest VIP financing, VIP easy returns, exclusive offers, all with no annual fee. Apply now. Call 1-800-695-1418 or search HSN card at hsn.com. Here at HSN, we base our retail values on nationwide information. Retail value is an indication of the price you would expect to pay for the same or similar item elsewhere, not the price at which you would be able to sell the item. Prices do vary around the country, so ours might be different from prices in your area. For more information, call one of our customer service reps at 1-800-284-3900. I'm Guy Yovan. We are so excited about this show. You know, I got to work with Michael, uh, my next guest, and you've seen him all over the place. He's, he's such a great guy. When it comes to gardening, the man knows everything. He's been doing it since, and I will use your term, since you were a wee lad. He's doing this since he was a, a little tiny guy, and he knows all about it. In fact, Michael, come on. I will just get you right out of here, because I know we don't have a lot of time. Oh, how's Good to see you, man? buddy. Good yeah, see yeah. You. So last time Michael was here, virtually everything we had sold out. Uh -huh. We don't have a lot of qu uh, quantity in anything, uh, but the stuff is absolutely beautiful, because it comes from Meadow Valley. And absolutely. I know you've got an association with them Meadow Valley, we're looking at new, different, unusual plants, plants that can answer questions in your garden. So yeah. if you're looking to fill a space, maybe you've got an awkward corner, an area of soil that you can't find anything yeah. to establish in, then we've got the answers here for you. This, whatever, this smells so amazing. Oh, okay. these, are tree, <laughs> these are tree lilies. Yeah, now explain to me oh. the difference because these are real big. These right? are not just standard lilies. These are gonna grow more than six feet in your yard on the terrace, on the balcony. Only so only $20 for this? Exactly, okay, right, so you can now out. have lilies as tall as yourself. Oh my gosh. It answers a lot of questions as well because it means that the pollen isn't staining your clothes, Love it's it. staining your nose, which is a lot easier Look to rub off. how big they are. I know, they're not only tall, but the blooms are one foot across as well. <laughs> These are dinner plate size blooms. They've got the richest perfume you could yeah. imagine. The flowers are in this gorgeous crystal white as well. These are hard to find in the stores. So if you want to have that real big presence in right. your yard this summer, yep. because these are going to flower this year as well. Yeah. You're going to plant them as soon as you receive them and you'll okay. get the first flowers in July. Yeah. Let's talk about when you order what you get, because I, mm. when I look at the stock that you guys hand out, it's, I mean, you're not going to find stuff like this in the garden store. Absolutely this not. This is curated from these guys from Meadow Valley. And look at these big, beautiful, <laughs> giant bulbs here. Oh, my gosh. So we're always sending you top size, flowering size bulbs. So when you go along to the store or right. the DIY store, you cannot be sure if the bulbs that you see in there are flowering size, but we guarantee that these are guaranteed to flower. So these will bloom in their first year, and the lilies are perennial as well, so they will flower this year and every year after as well. So these are hardy, they just die back to the base in the fall. Six feet tall in the first year, getting up to almost 10 feet by the third year. These are incredibly big presences for your yard. Lovely big white dinner plate blooms, easy to grow in sun or shade, blooming from midsummer through to fall. You're gonna grow these as a hedge as well. Okay. Or maybe in a patio container. So incredibly versatile. And remember, you don't need much space. These are space saving because they're growing upwards and yeah, not outwards. Exactly, so they're not like a bush or a yeah. shrub or anything you have to deal with. Exactly. And they will provide perfect accents. So a lot of people, you know, they say, okay, listen, Michael, so you're, you're, the, you know, you're a garden guru. You know all mm -hmm. this stuff inside you, but how do I know? We actually, when you order this, okay, and Rob's gonna put this up, thank you so much, but when you order, 
We're not going to send it to you until it's ready to be planted in, in the area that you live, correct? Absolutely. So we're going to send you the bulbs when they're dormant, and then we're going to send you at the right time for your state. So we're not going to send them when your ground is still frozen or the Perfect. conditions aren't ready right. for planting. So you are guaranteed success in whichever state you live, in whichever type of yard or patio or terrace that you're working with, yeah. you can have these tree lilies six I, feet of look, flowers. And I love seeing And Michael shows you the right way to do it. So, yep, so, so I planted these really, really really quickly so I want to show you that it takes you literally 20 seconds to plant these okay. into your container so I'm planting those at two inches deep and with the shoot upwards so you'll notice at the base this spidery root system which right. is very healthy and that's exactly what you want when you're buying bulbs from anywhere goes at the base and then you've got the shoot at the top so that is the way up we're planting it we're covering those over with soil and we will start to see growth on those within about four to five weeks okay. and, and flowers and do you want by any showing too. or just barely covered you're going to put another inch of compost on top okay. of that so okay. they're going to be about an inch or so deep perfect but remember everything has got full instructions with meadow valley as well all right step by step instructions to help you get the best from and, everything we're offering and, you. And Michael, tell me, because I know a lot of people think, oh, I can go get this at the local garden store. Mm. Why do we, why is Meadow Valley like the go-to? Why should we go to them? Well, we're bringing you the things that are new, different, unusual, the things that we pulled out of trial programs in order to offer you something that cannot be found in the stores. So something that may be a different color, right. taller or shorter. These lilies are very hard to get hold of, and we've shipped these across from Holland, where they grow lots and lots of unusual and different bulbs. Right. And that's why we can offer you these tree lilies. These are actually redundant cut flower varieties okay. that aren't used anymore, but we've now offered them to gardeners so that they can have those long stems yeah. and big shrubby lilies at the back of their border or on the patio or balcony. And can we show, like, this, mm. is this how they look when they really get established? Is that what yeah, they look like? Yeah, absolutely. Look over so here, this guys. is our look, look, example look. of how a tree <laughs> lily could look oh, on awesome. your balcony, on your deck. In oh the first gosh. year, they're going to grow five feet. Can you imagine walking out on your deck, you have a cup of coffee, and then you uh, smell that lily. And the fragrance that is just here. That lily perfume is in the air. I mean, what And usually you've got, to, you've got to bend down to smell right, the fragrance. Right. You're going to get the pollen on your nose, <laughs> all the stains yeah. on your clothes. Here, yeah. it's there, and it's convenient. The pollen, the fragrance, the beauty, everything oh. is at nose and eye level. You could flank the exit of a patio, the entryway mm. to, to your home you could do, uh, as long as you're getting sun. I mean, think about this. So here's the thing, as I said with Michael and Meadow Valley, you know, they don't bring in, we don't get a lot. We, we get a, a limited amount because, you know, this is, this is a big time company that really, you know, they take pride in what they have. Mm. They don't, they, they, there's not an unending supply. So we only have, Rob, what do we have? 700 to start. Rob says we're down under 500, mm -hmm. maybe, maybe under 400 with everybody mm -hmm. online. It's a $20 bill. You telling me that these, that these trees, mm. and, and you should have enough to get what, three of those trees? And yep. after it's grown? You'll have three like this. Oh my God. Three like that in your garden. It is the tree lily, like the skyscraper lily growing. Yeah six to eight feet and it's perennial as well so it comes back every year so you'll have that same display every season it just oh. dies back in the fall and then bounces back the following spring you can cut some for indoors yeah. fragrance color and the flowers in themselves are a foot across so the flowers are dinner yeah, plate big. size yeah, some you, of the biggest lilies out there if you look at some of our footage when we showed this you know obviously you know wh you know whatever growing season you mm. have um they're going to grow huge and you're going to get that big sort of an open mm. blossom anyway it's 4.99 on flex day we have a lot to talk about in the show so we're going to move on but this is uh there's about 300 or so remaining of that 4.99 as i said and reduced shipping if you'd like to get it grab it it's 538-499 all right we are going to move on. Hey, by the way, before we move on, I wanted to mention, thank you so much for reminding me, Rob. We have free shipping on some lawn and garden stuff uh, over there at hsn.com. So if you click that little green icon that says outdoor, uh, click on that and uh, you'll see which we have. We also have up to 30% off on some of your other items, uh, Spring Home Favorites, which is kind of what our show is all about. Um, so if you're looking to decorate and use some uh, home decor, uh, you can get 30% off and you can get flex pay on uh, very select, on all select items in there. Okay, all right, so this is one that I will tell you I'm in love with because oh. my dad, my dad at his old property up in Connecticut, uh -huh. uh, his favorite plants were lilac. He uh -huh. had lilac bushes everywhere, which are amazing. Uh -huh. And along the ground, he had lily of the valley and the, the combination uh -huh 
with so many, but I've never seen pink. It's amazing. Ever. I'm so excited to bring this here because it's a rare variety of Lily of the Valley. It's yeah. always in short supply and it's always in such demand, but we've been able to bring you some here today and it is just the same as the traditional Lily of the Valley, so it's just as easy to grow. It's got right. that same delicious fragrance, but it's got the blushed pink flowers. It's just so look pretty. at them. Come in Absolutely close. Yeah. gorgeous. See that? That's Lily great, of the guys. Valley is an incredibly easy to grow plant for a yeah. shady corner. It thrives in conditions of dry, so dry shady corners, those difficult areas of the garden, maybe beneath trees and shrubs, maybe where right. there's a lot of tree roots that are sapping a lot of goodness out of the Look soil, Lily of the Valley will Little establish. Bells, but, right? Little bells. Oh, it's gorgeous, <laughs> but this is the blush pink variety, so this is the rare pink Lily of the Valley. It doesn't only look good in the spring, but also the fall color on yeah. Lily of the Valley is gorgeous. The leaves turn this lovely auburn, and the berries are a beautiful red oh. as well. So, so you this isn't just for one season. All right. But of course, cut them for indoors. Yeah, beautiful and, and posies. We're only spending a couple minutes on this, mm. but, but um, my producer Rob just said, guy, there's 300. So if you love Lily of the Valley, traditionally you love the scent, which is the most beautiful. I mean, think how many, how many perfume companies put Lily of the Valley in mm. their, in the, as a, a foundation of their scents? I would say probably 70, 80, 90% of them when they're creating a beautiful perfume for women. <clears throat> so you're gonna get that scent outside your property and it is amazing. It is unlike anything else, you know, I, like I said, my favorite scent on this earth has always been uh, lilac. I always love that. It reminds me of my dad too, but I, uh -huh. our, our house kind of smelled like that when you came inside. But the lily of the valley was down in the garden. He had a rock garden and he had it growing with rocks around it and it uh, was beautiful. It's, it's... Oh, it was, and it was, you know, it's so funny because my dad was this, you know, football coach kind of guy. He loved mm. the garden. It was his way to kind of uh, take it down and be real. <laughs> it's so, an amazing part. It's, it's almost fun. magical. And I love the yeah. display we've got here today with the rare pink lily of the valley. It's absolutely gorgeous. It smells divine. But aside from all that, it's an easy to grow plant in the garden as well. It's okay. very useful in those difficult shady corners, but also in containers. And you've seen how quickly and easily you can plant those up as well. You're planting the bare root plants just an inch below the soil. And again, we're offering you those flowering size plants. It's hard to find flowering size plants of lily of the valley in the garden centers, DIY stores, let alone the pink. Right. The pink yeah. is incredibly rare and we're shipping this across from Holland for you guys. Yeah, and I think that's what gardeners love. They love to have something that's unique and mm -hmm. new. And I think that's so great mm -hmm. about you coming in Meadow Valley is that we don't get the run of the mill. Hey, listen, we can all Absolutely go to the home store not. and get roses, mm -hmm. okay? Mm -hmm. We can go get a rose bush mm -hmm. and we can plant it and, and, and we, you know, we mm -hmm. hope everything grows. But you're not gonna find these unique varieties, which really is mm -hmm. what makes a garden. People come to your house, they're gonna look and they're gonna be like, what is, yeah. what is that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you're gonna be like, oh, I got it's it, gorgeous. nobody else has it. If you cool. can find pink lily of the valley <laughs> in the stores, then good luck. Yeah, good luck for you. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> All right, we're down to 200 left. Uh, if you would like them, actually less than that, about 150 remaining. We have only 30 seconds left. So you get these home, you're gonna get four of the, uh, of the uh, uh, field-grown dormant lilies mm -hmm. as, um, as we said, as Michael said, just about an inch under the soil mm -hmm. and put them with tips up. Always remember the points Absolutely. up, Absolutely, right? but you will have full instructions step by step. So okay. if you're a beginner, you've never ordered any plants from Meadow Valley before, right. everything will be included in the pack to help you get the best from those plants. Beautiful. And remember, uh, we have the peonies coming up and you and I, last time, remember we sold out the, the mm. peony Well, this variety. is a real English a gardening different. section yeah. here. Yeah, really multi, is. multi uh, level, uh, layered flowers. Yes. Again, multicolored, oh, really beautiful. Well, this, there's three different colors this time. So we've Love got it. a red, a pink, and a crystal white. Love it, all right, there they are. There's <laughs> a sneak peek that's coming up a little bit later. Remember the last time we brought our lily uh, collection? It wasn't quite this one, but it sold out very, very quickly. So if you would like it, now's the time to get it. So. I was doing my research for the show and I saw that we had the uh, the strawberry plant. And then when I look at how beautiful, you know, <laughs> we've got some planted here. If you love strawberries, I mean a lot of them because they're, there's the, the, the uh, crop on this. You just thought you were gonna get your breakfast. You're gonna you? have That's your breakfast it. every day. <laughs> then you need to order this, oh my gosh, sweet, delicious strawberries. You can use this as a pot. You can hang this in a basket if you mm, want. Absolutely. But these are amazing. And Michael, you're gonna give us, what, we had six of the plants. You're getting six plants. Okay. Of Elan, which is a professional grade variety. Okay. So this is the variety that the professionals grow, but you will be able to grow sweeter than them at home. 
because when you grow your own, that sweetness, you're picking them straight from the plant. Wow, you're experiencing high levels of vitamins as well. Did you know strawberries contain vitamin C? Yeah. A lot of people assume that's just in oranges and citrus, right. but there's oh, lots loaded. in strawberries as well. There's also fiber. They're one of the fruits. Ever so good for you. And they're one you. of the fruits you, you do eat when you're on a diet. Mm. There's a lot of fruits Absolute, that are... Yeah, berries are all good for you. All berries all are great for you. You know, there's certain fruits that mm. they say, you know, there's so much high sugar content that you got to be careful. Yeah, yeah. These are sweet and delicious, but they're uh, the fruit sugar that's inside is good for you when you are trying to diet because we, we could put them on a salad. You can mm. have them in dessert, whatever. If you're looking to lose weight, then go the salad mm. route. Absolutely. <laughs> so we're giving you six pot-grown plants. So these are not dormant plants. These are growing plants. Okay. So these are the same grade as you'd find in the garden center, but in a variety which is harder to get hold of. You're going to plant those up into your containers or your baskets really, really simply. You're going to plant them into a good draining soil and you're going to put them into a sunny position. When you grow your strawberries in baskets or containers, you'll get better crops as well because the fruit will be a lot cleaner and it won't be dragging on the ground as it does when you grow them in open ground. Right. But remember, each of these plants is going to give you three pounds of fruit. So can you imagine that? Look, this is three pounds of fruit that we've... Yeah. Example here plant. from the supermarket. Wow. But you could grow this yourself from just one plant this season. So imagine you're getting six times free. That's 18, That's 18 pounds, of fruit. pounds of fruit. It's amazing. And it's fruit that will taste better as well. Oh my it will gosh. taste sweeter. It yeah. will be succulent. It will be ripe as well. Oh. You know when you buy fruit from the store and it's still unripe and it's kind right. of hard and they pick this it early right is yeah. the professional grade variety it's also easier it's a variety which is easier to hull as well so it's easier to take oh the God. stalk out of the front of the fruit amazingly easy to grow brilliant value and one of those professional grade varieties yeah and you can grow it anywhere i, feel, I love the idea of a hanging basket right outside on your porch so you can mm. pull and pick the strawberries the off. fragrance yeah. of a strawberry as well yeah. is incredible oh my gosh i love it oh. and remember these have uh, it says that these also uh, have some kind of a blossom it's like yes. a snowy color or whatever it is so these have lovely white blossoms so they even look good before they fruit awesome. and of course remember this is elan which is an ever bearing variety so those three pounds of fruit will be all through the season as well so from july through to september you will keep getting fruit on your plants so you will avoid awesome. gluts yeah you won't have all the fruit at the same time it's right. an ever bearing variety that happens a lot and with they tomatoes. are the best type yeah. of strawberry we have that grow. issue with tomatoes there are so many tomatoes yeah, you can't exactly. give them away no, this is nicely coordinated all Perfect. through the season from yeah. July to September and three pounds per plant in total. And the scent of strawberry is so amazing. Mm. It's all over the place here. So if you'd like to get this, remember you're going to get, uh, you get six of the plants. Uh, they are ready for planting. As we said, uh, these are ready to go. Uh, it's the Elon variety. And as, as mm -hmm. we said, Michael said, you know, good luck trying to find that outside uh, of, of right here at HSN, unless you go, you know, through Meadow Valley. Tough to find. That's what Michael brings. He brings a lot of varieties that you don't see everywhere else mm -hmm. with good reason not just because they're different but because they are maybe a little more tolerant mm. they're easier they're a little more user friendly for mm. you out there but you don't sacrifice anything and you can see um how you plant these now as far as put how close you plant them is that about how you want to do you're it you're going to put inches? about two to three inches right. apart so in a container which is 12 inches across you're going to put two plants into there but remember these are a variety you can buy in the stores but when you grow them yourself yeah they're going to be sweeter and you've got zero food miles as well. You can pick them straight from the plant and experience I love that. the real sweetness of a strawberry yeah. until you've grown your own strawberries. You don't understand how sweet they can be. I know. That's the thing. And, and remember, yeah. too, what's nice about this is if you live in an apartment, mm. very apartment Balcony, friendly. Balcony, window box, right? <clears throat> any space, even the windowsill indoors, the window ledge. Wow. As an indoor that. plant oh in God. a sunny window. Yeah. So there's no excuse yeah. not to try well, and grow your own strawberries. Maybe have it with your herb garden, right? You have mm. a little herb garden. Maybe you just want to have something living mm -hmm. in your house I've got 900 left if you want to get this I'm hoping in a way we don't sell them all out because I'd like to get some of these <laughs> well because you I told you before I, I have a small yard so all my gardening stuff is on my deck mm. I love it out there mm. because I can control it I like to sit out and have coffee mm -hmm. and look at all that stuff imagine walking outside and seeing that waiting you or that uh, waiting you beautiful. wonderful well you'd probably smell it before you could see yeah <laughs> all right it's 602330 brand new if you'd like to pick it up it's on flex pay as well at only seven dollars and 49 cents uh and as we said all user friendly remember uh when we talk about hsn here we're gonna tell you we're gonna tell you when you need to plan it we have our planning guide that tells you you won't receive anything until it's right in your wherever you live 
All right, we'll, we'll show you that really quick. Mm -hmm. So we will only we'll only ship it to you when it's ready to be planted. Exactly, right? the right time for planting in your state. So we're not going to send you plants that you cannot deal with at yeah. the time. Okay. All right, if you want strawberries, last call on those. By the way, we started with the pretty women. If you want those, mm -hmm. what they call tree lilies, which I'd never heard of, and you want lilies that are five, six feet tall, my producer Rob says, Guy, there's a hundred, a little over a hundred remaining. And those are wonderful because you don't have to bend over to smell them. Oh, it's the They're wow. Right in your face. It's the wow plant of the yeah. lily world. It's the lily that everybody wants to grow. Not only are they six foot tall, but the flowers are a foot across and with that richest perfume as well. Oh my goodness. So you can create that beautiful environment for you and your family. Lily of the Valley, uh, we are also very limited on that. Remember, this is the pink variety that Michael said, so rare. And you won't find this in oh, a regular garden store. It's absolutely beautiful. Always very, very hard to get a hold of. And it's a really simple plant to grow. Sometimes you think the more unusual, the more precious the plant is, right. it's going to be difficult to grow. But no, this is great for shady corners, planting beneath trees yeah. and shrubs. Any of those spare corners of the garden, you know, fill that I in, especially them. dry shade as well, and yeah. containers. They're so pretty, like little bells. You're gonna love those. <laughs> and those are great whether you want it. We said you want to do containers or if you want to put them out for some ground cover. All right, I know it's, we're already at the last item. Oh, with you no and me. I know, we had a whole hour last time. <laughs> they only gave us a half hour, but we don't have a lot of stuff to go around. In fact, this, this is probably gonna sell out very, very quickly, mm. so we may have to go back to some other things. This is our peony collection. This is the three-piece. Mm. Everybody talks about this, the incredible range of color, oh. uh, the incredible fragrance. This is perfect for springtime and early summer. And what I love, too, is you've told me in the past, mm. these are not real fussy. We can grow Not these. at all. Yeah. It's amazing, again, because peonies, they look extremely delicate, but they're actually one of the most resilient and easy oh, to grow plants smell. that you can find. They're pest and disease free. Mm. They last for more than 20, 30 years in the garden as well. Mm. They'll grow in sun or partial shade. And what we're giving you is three different colors as well. So you've got the deep red, you've got the pink, and you've got the crystal white with the lovely buttery center as well. Wow. The fragrance is Oh, it's second to none. It's yeah. the base of many, many perfumes, scented candles. And again, we're offering you those dormant bare root plants. So this is a great saving on the way to buy your peonies. Because if yeah. you went along to the DIY store or the garden center, you could find peonies there, but you'd be paying for the container, the dirt, you right, know, you'd be right. outlaying a lot that you don't need to. But we're sending these direct from the nurseries in Holland. So these are dormant plants. So these are basically plants that are asleep. It is the best time to lift them from the nursery right. and plant them into your garden. While they're resting. Just do it yeah. and see the results because they won't even know they've been moved. And so this is gonna save you a lot of dollars. It's also gonna help them establish a lot easier because they aren't being disturbed whilst they're in growth. You may look at, think it looks like a bit of a dead sausage. No, it looks like, it looks like, it looks like something out of Harry Potter, right? You remember the little Harry Potter thing they were replanting? But, but it is a the bare little, root plant. See the little red buds? And it's dormant. See them? And you will see there's more than one bud as well, which is the sign of a great quality peony. See them all? Once you start buying these dormant bare root plants, you won't be able to stop because you realize that this is the better way to plant into your garden. Plant it up while everything is dormant and then everything will bounce into action in the spring. So you can plant those into the border, into a range of different soils, or you can plant them into large containers. Mm -hmm. You're gonna get your first blooms within a couple of seasons and they're gonna last more than 20 years as well. Peonies are known for being one of the toughest, most resilient plants. They last mm -hmm. a lifetime and they give you these amazing displays of flamboyant flowers every May as well. So without fail, yeah. they will bloom every year, giving you those rich perfumes. And yep. you've got three different colors here as well. Some okay. of the best, most traditional colors. Uh, and I love A them. Classic for, English farm again. Yeah, if you're doing mm. cuttings, right? Yes. And you want to bring something in the house or if you want to give somebody flowers, uh -huh. What's better than being able to give your neighbor or somebody that maybe got your mail for you or whatever mm. a little handful of flowers when you get home and it costs mm. you nothing and it means everything to people. Like I, if somebody came, if a neighbor came over and said thanks for watching my house and <laughs> gave me these, yeah. I'd probably t well up. I'd be like, oh my god, you gave me flowers. I love that. Uh, it really is a nice thing and and it's such a wonderful. It's so rewarding when you see mm. the colors come out and I love that you guys have already uh, curated the the blend we of have. color. We have. We know that they're going to look good together. So if you want to uh, plant these. Alongside the pathway, yeah. maybe in a row against the fence, then they're going to look really great. 
peony plants are well rounded as well. They're very good shaped yeah. plants. And you can see some more examples at the front here to show you the display that you could have right. in your yard. So in the backyard, front yard, large containers. You're gonna get those blossoms every year yeah. around May time, uh -huh. and they're gonna persist on the plants for a few weeks. You're also gonna have decorative foliage as well. The foliage on a peony is very attractive really. and turns great colors in the yeah. fall too. It's very so deep, absolutely. right, very deep green. It's and such an amazing flamboyant yeah. bloom. And look at the flowers here, mm. and I wanna be, I mean, I, this is a cut one, so I'm trying to be delicate, but do you see the multi layers? They're mm. so packed. And then deep inside there, you can see, and the scent comes from the whole flower. Absolutely, it's so like the scent you... is coming from the center of that bloom, and because oh you've gosh. got more petals Amazing. than standard peonies, you're getting more fragrance as well. So they're big, that's a real one. they're flamboyant. <laughs> Right. And they'll last indoors for a few weeks in a vase as well. Yeah, look at so, how beautiful. Amazing and, quality. And the leaves, they're this deep, deep green mm. color, and they offset the color. See that? They offset the color so well. And mm. look, and these have been cut, and there's only one little, there's only one little leaf in the back where <laughs> you can see it's kind of drying out. But but that's hardy. These are out of water. Absolutely. And they're still holding their shape and they're mm. beautiful. And the scent. Oh my gosh, I, I, you know, I, I just, it's so funny because I know the scent of roses, I know the scent of lilac uh. and, the, and of lily of the valley, but peony, I forget how beautiful mm. it is. It's, it's the fragrance it's, of England. It's, 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 it's totally, <laughs> it is, it's very exotic, but at the same time, it's very regal and very, Ooh. like this is what you would want an English garden to smell like. It's just beautiful. You don't need to buy any more candles. You can just no, buy the peonies no. and grow your own blooms. Wow. Remember, you're going from a dormant bare root plant yeah. to that beauty within just a couple of seasons. It's the wise way to grow your peony plants as well because they're dormant plants which are asleep and they're lifted from the nurseries in Holland oh and gosh. sent to you at the right time for planting in your state. All right, so we have a use and care on this. And uh, as Michael said, these can take full to part day sun uh, so again they're they're pretty hardy mm -hmm. these will bloom uh, late spring to early summer that's when they start and then Michael said you can expect them to the, the blooms to last for mm. for weeks uh, you get uh, we show you the planting distance we show you how big they're gonna get and we show you how they're gonna spread over time and remember you know gardening like anything else is sort of similar to raising children mm. you know they grow <laughs> bigger they As do. year after year. These peonies are going to right? last a lifetime. Yeah. They will be passed down through generation to generation, giving those gorgeous, deeply fragrant blooms every season. And the colors are vintage style right. English. I brought you so many amazing English flowers here today that you've got to find a yeah. space in your yard for some of these. Remember, Michael only gets to bring so much stuff out because we have limited time. But mm. if you want to go to Meadow Valley on hsn.com. Absolutely, look on the website and you'll see the full range of what we can offer you. Everything that he's got there. So I know a lot of you are real, well, you should mm. be particular about what you put in your garden. What we try to do is give you some things that are very unusual and some things that are staple. And mm. also we want things that are gonna grow for you. And again, we, we, we try to eliminate down to, down to zero. Uh, the, a non-growing plant by by sending it to you when it's the right mm -hmm. time to plant it by giving you the instructions like as I even saw that well you know with strawberries mm. you know and I read this it's like use an organic mm. um, fertilizer on there because you're gonna be eating them absolutely so you don't want to yeah. put a chemical yeah. thing on there not, so he even mm. they even tell you that you know all the information that you of need course. $39.95. I know it's been short, but very, very sweet, and the place smells wonderful, thanks to this gentleman. <laughs> it's always good to see thanks, you, sir. Thanks, man. Really fun. I hope, are you back again some throughout the uh, day sometime? I'll be back at 1 a.m. All right, cool. We'll see so, you again yeah, soon, Michael. Then. Fantastic no job. Uh, thanks so much uh, for joining me. Uh, we have a great show next Tuesday. I'm not sure if it's me. It might be. Our at-home show uh, returns Tuesday at 9 a.m. What's in that show, Rob? Do we know? A healthy home. So that's fantastic. So if you want to learn ways to be healthy and to feel good. We can do that for you, so, so keep on the lookout for that. I want to remind you again of our today's special. Is this the pre-sale? Yeah, 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 really quickly. If you would like to get the pressure washer, hundreds of you pre-selected, it doesn't launch until tonight at, at midnight. Rob says close to 300 already gone in just a sneak peek. And I congratulate you, because you're gonna love having your own pressure washer. It's the best way to clean up around the house. So you're gonna absolutely love that. For those of you that are looking to clean your teeth and make them white and bright, I see Dr. Jablo's here. Hi, Dr. Jablo. How are you, darling? So as I step out of the shot, sorry. Uh, so if you'd like to get your teeth there whitest, she's gonna show you how to do that. Uh, we've got our monthly special coming your way next, and then I'll see you guys over the weekend. Have a happy and safe and healthy Easter.
And I cannot believe being a host here at HSN, I've never had the chance to share with you origami. It's the first time I'm selling this, but you've loved it. There's well over a thousand reviews on hsn.com. $24.99 gets it home. Luca Puto is our shelving and origami expert. We're gonna jump right into this. All the origami pieces that you're seeing tonight are made of powder coated steel. They're gonna be chip resistant, scratch resistant, and corrosion resistant, so you can use them indoors oh. and out. And this woman right here is showing you exactly how simple it is to do. Anybody can put these together. Well, if we real quick look at the colors right here, this is the beautiful teal that we have available tonight. Then we have the platinum next to that, followed by the gorgeous crisp clean white. We've got the beautiful sage right here. Take a look at that. Then we have the light yellow. We've got the black right here. Next to that, we've got the vintage bronze, great with that leather or wood. We've got the orange, we've got the turquoise, the cranberry, the navy blue, and finishing it up, the emerald. This is the kind of origami piece that will work in any area of your home. You know, the smaller rooms in the house. Think about the bathrooms, the kitchens. If you want a straight up bookshelf, you cannot beat this. But what we are doing today is not only a monthly special, this is something better than a today's special because when you buy one at $99.95 spring price, you get a second one $20 dollars off which would bring it to 79.95 so we already took 20 dollars off we're gonna take another 20 dollars off and your second one to ship is only two dollars and fifty cents so it's an amazing deal one is 99 mm -hmm. the second one is 79 so you're spending today 178 and then you're only spending seven dollars to ship it so it's a huge savings that we're able to offer for you you're seeing it first read the reviews it's our monthly special we've never done it before with this high-end designer flair to it i love the way that this is designed so if you want it pick up your color before we lose colors because rose already sold out